Hey guys, Sean Putnam here with Chopper Karma. I just want to show you a video explaining some of the differences of the film that we offer. So that way when you do decide to make a decision to tent your vehicle, you have more information, you kind of get an idea of what we offer, uh, how it performs, the differences between them, and knowing what you're paying for. So that way you're better equipped to make a good decision. I hope this video helps. Okay everybody, this is a uh, standard heat box test that I show everybody. Right here I have a uh, BTU meter that I use uh, to kind of show the power, the power of the heat that you're going to feel from this red light here. Uh, this is just your standard uh, heat lamp like you see uh, in any aquarium. So I turn this on, this rates BTUs. Uh, you know, I'm not very scientific, but uh, when this goes outside, the solar power BTU reads about 250 to 260 on a really bright day in Florida. So I like to put this right where I can meter it. Just want to kind of see where it's at, 228, so we get a little closer, usually right to the ruler. I would call it 255, yeah, that's what it's like on a hot day in Florida. So we're gonna kind of compare uh, the films. So uh, this right here, there's a 20% dyed film that I have installed on this glass. And when I put it in here to represent what it's like to be on your car, number is 255, number goes down to 203. So, you know, it takes it down, you know, almost 50, 50 BTUs. I mean, what does that mean, right? Well, I'm gonna show you in just a minute so you can kind of compare. But this is your standard dyed film. This is actually a 20%. It's a really good film, it's from a major uh, maker, so I use that as an example. Uh, then we have our first level that we offer, which is a carbon. It's a 20% carbon. So this would be if you just want it to look good, I block a little bit of the heat. So we turn it on here. As you can see, the other one was what, 205? This is 143. So it takes it down quite a bit. Uh, but if your hand was here, you know, you would still feel that from from right here is where you'd feel it. But let's just keep going because we're just gonna show you numbers because it's just a video, so it makes more sense. Then we go on to uh, what I call our mid-range ceramic. This is a 20% film. Uh, we're gonna put it in here. We're gonna crank it on and see what we get. 41, so 41 out of 255. Uh, so you can see that's much better even than the uh, carbon that we had. Just took it down so there's like another 100 BTUs more so you know we get the dyed film it takes off about you know, about 50 BTUs then the carbon takes it down you know another 50 or so give or take and this one takes it down 100 so you can kind of see the difference between that first level ceramic and our carbon then if you want to go to what I call our high performance ceramic put this in this one's rated at 93% I believe uh, IR rejection, which again, you know, if we're math majors, we can kind of figure this out here just by watching this. But 255 down to 23, 24. That's not too bad. That's better than the 41 that we had with the other one. So that's kind of the difference you're you're paying for when you go to a higher performance ceramic. Now, not risking this BTU meter turning off, I'm going to show you the windshield film that we use. Uh, let me turn this off and back on because it goes off and on pretty quick. Make sure it's still showing about 250s. Not 260, yeah, there you go, it's on a hot day. So we use a 70% film for our windshield. As you can see, it's very clear. It kind of has a blue hue to it, but once you install it on the, on the glass, you don't notice it as much. Uh, but this is a high-performing ceramic film as well. And remember, we had, what, a 22, 23 with our high-performance uh, ceramic goes on the side. Well, this one, because it goes on the windshield, this one performs a lot better, and I'll show you. 15, 16, give or take. That's quite a significant drop for BTUs. So, whenever you have to find out what you're paying for, when you go between, you know, your basic dyes, which we don't sell that, or I should say uh, color stable, whatever you want to call it, even to a carbon, there's a slight difference in performance, but once you start going to ceramic, uh, the BTU doesn't lie. Now, if you're here, I'll show this. You can put your hand in it. You can feel for yourself so you don't have to believe me. Uh, but just call, and I'd be happy to show you and demonstrate. 
All right, like I said in the video, uh, you're welcome to give us a call. Stop by. Our uh, phone number is 239-829-8381. Uh, we can schedule a demo if you want to come and see the, uh, the heat box for yourself. Uh, we are located at 16010 Old 41 North, Unit 111, and that's in Naples, 34110. We're just south of the Kenworth uh, truck building, so stop by and say hi.